hello all welcome back to our channel so in this video we're gonna discuss the important questions of economics for management or else efm which is you are having in your mba first year first semester so whatever the questions i'm giving in this video is enough to attempt full question paper in your final examination if you want only passing marks also you can easily pass marks you can easily get passed in this subject by watching and following my tips in this video whichever i am giving okay so in this video clearly i will discuss about the syllabus content what you are having and question paper pattern what are the important questions everything so don't skip the video and watch till the end because this year your syllabus has reduced and question paper has changed right so that's why i will give each and every tip and uh, detailed information about this economics for managers that is efm subjects okay so let's get into the video first we will discuss about the question paper pattern so in part a you will have five questions you need to attempt all that five questions each carries two marks okay so part a consisting of 10 marks so for two marks five to six lines is more than enough in your final examination in answer booklet okay so for part a is little bit easy only don't concentrate that much on part a if you are perfect with the long questions you can easily attempt this part a and you can easily score 10 on 10 marks in part a and in regarding part b so five questions you need to attempt each question carries eight marks so part b consisting of 40 marks okay so from sixth question to tenth question you will have in your part a part b sorry and uh, in each question you will have internal choice okay like a or b six a or b okay sixth question will come from unit number one seventh question will come from unit number two eighth question will come from unit number three ninth and tenth will come from unit number four and five okay and the crucial section in every question paper is part c that is 10 marks for case study so this year this case study has been included in the question paper so total 60 marks question paper as you all know this is the part c section they will give some paragraph regarding the paragraph they will give some of the important questions so you need to attempt that questions okay that is called the case study you need to study the case they will give particular case according to that case whatever the they may ask the situations the, they may ask subject related thing according to that uh, you can easily attempt it okay in this section i am not at all giving any important questions this section 10 marks is purely depends on your thinking level creative thinking anything if you want to prefer any announcements you can prefer cr material okay and the syllabus content is you are having like unit number one is introduction of economics in this uh, the main important topics i have underlined it like nature and scope of managerial economics fundamental concepts of managerial economics means like one question definitely come from managerial economics whether it may be a functions nature scope relation with other subject whatever it may be that will come and unit number two that is economic theories okay in this unit law of marginal utility law of demand and types of elasticity of demand okay what is the price like this type of concept is very much important and in third unit that is theories of production in that you will have law of two variable proportions law of returns to scale long term curves and short term curves like that in unit number four you will learn about the monopolistic competition perfect competition monopoly oligopoly like this in fifth unit national income inflation and uh, coming back to the long important questions for part b uh, in each question i have given five five questions so prepare all these five questions okay already i have reduced the full uh, like many questions are there in each and every unit already i have reduced many things so in this we can't predict anything if you want to score full on full marks in subject means you need to learn all these five questions okay nature and scope of managerial economics opportunity cost and its importance is important okay so managerial economics is also important okay from unit number two also law of diminishing marginal utility you have already learned in your fifth semester in intermediate also you have learned in commerce subject so it will be a that type of 
uh, topics only will have in your MBA also. Okay, and what are the factors influencing demand? What is mean by law of demand? What are its assumptions and exceptions? Price elasticity of demand and different types of price elasticity of demand. Whatever we are having, you need to write the answer along with the diagrams. Diagrams also we are having, so you need to draw the diagrams. Okay, and from unit number three. I have given again five questions: law of returns to scale, law of variable proportion. Okay, so different concepts of cost, which is useful for managerial decision making. This is also an important concept which you are having in your third unit. You will learn. So just concentrate and learn returns to scale and law of variable proportions. Out of these two concept, one question will be come in the like from. Like eighth question, okay. So unit number four again, I have given five questions. Oligopoly is one of the most important and the repeated question. Monopolistic competition and also uh, price and output determination under profit competition. Okay, oligopoly, monopoly, monopolistic competition. These are the three concepts which is very much important in unit number four. Okay, so diagrams also you are having. Just look into the materials and try to learn the concepts, or else you can follow the classes in YouTube. Okay, various. Uh, lecturers have explained in youtube right so unit number 5 i have given only four questions measurements of national income inflation and its types and what are the causes of inflation these are the three important question okay fiscal policy is like not that much easy so just concentrate on national income and inflation out of these two concepts one question will definitely they will ask in long okay either they may ask national income or inflation or they may ask both the questions for long okay and uh, for part A again, uh, I will keep on saying that don't need to learn any specific questions for part A because if you are perfect with part B questions, long questions, you can easily attempt short also. But I will give the short questions also for your satisfaction. So opportunity cost, decision making, equi marginal principle, managerial economics, and times perspective these are the five important questions which i have given in unit number one and from unit number two demand function marginal utility cross elasticity of demand consumer equilibrium law of demand this type of questions already if you are perfect with the long questions you can easily write all the short questions easily okay five to six lines is more than enough in your booklet okay so for two marks don't write lengthy lengthy answers because time will be not sufficient okay so two and a half hours only it will be there right and from unit number three cost function bp that is break even point fixed cost iso quant cost production function all these concepts are already included in long question here also kinkle demand curve oligopoly monopoly and fifth chapter budget war inflation all concepts are included in your long so just prepare long questions perfectly and try to attempt each and every question in uh, final examination if you don't know or know if you don't know the question also give an attempt okay so don't uh, uh, like don't leave any question for choice okay so if you don't know the question also try to attempt that question in your own way like two or three marks will be you can easily gain okay so for passing at least learn three units like according to me fifth unit is easy second unit is easy first unit is easy first second and fifth unit important questions whatever i have given in this video that is enough to score uh, like uh, 30 plus marks out of 60 marks okay if you easy you can easily get past marks in this subject okay economics okay all the very best for your examination as well as the preparation if you're having any doubts regarding this subject regarding this video you can comment me in the comment section if you think that this video is worthy uh, give a like share and subscribe to my channel and share with all your friends and groups of mba because uh, it will be helpful for me to do more videos regarding the mba uh, subject uh, like mba course so just don't forget to comment me in the comment section how you felt about the video and how is my explanation regarding this subject of mba okay so all the very best for your examination as well as the preparation if you are having any doubts you can message me uh, 
uh, comment section all the links were mentioned in the description box whatever the notes i'm available for mba i will upload it on in our telegram group telegram group link is also given in the description box okay once again all the very best and uh, thank you all see you all in next video bye bye